this week heading into Cape Range National Park, Ningaloo destination Mesa Campground. This place is awesome. You'll always find one with a bit of attitude. Mesa Campground. It's out of season. There's not very many people here. There's a lot of protected areas in Ningaloo where you can and cannot fish and this is obviously where you cannot fish and also my next destination you can't fish there either at Oyster Stacks. Oyster Stacks, Ningaloo Reef, where the reef meets the shore. Let's get in there, see if we can see some fish. This is Osprey and this one is T-Bone and this one is, I don't even know what it's called but look at that. So we're at Mesa Camp, Ningaloo Reef. Just going to throw this bad boy out, hopefully catch some live mullet. Brilliant bait, Karen. That's a kind of a garfish with an orange bit on it. Okay. Beautiful whiting. Yeah, brilliant bait. Wasn't expecting that in the lagoon. Shovel nose. <laughs> well, there's a shovel nose shark. More like a ray, but. Camp 
lightning glory. They're too fast. Oh, oh I've got someone in there. As long as you don't get out. Oh, I lost one there. Mullet. They're too big. <laughs> Yeah, there's the campground with my camp over there. Here. Ingaloo Coast, Mesa Campground, and it's a nice little um, lagoon. The waters are pretty safe anyway. I'm gonna go out to those rocks over there and uh, wet a line. Got some live bait, oh, not live bait anymore, with dead bait, but it was live when I caught it this morning. Anyway, let's get on. Okay, here we are, Ningaloo Coast. Stunning, absolutely stunning. Camps over there, that's where I've just come from. Lagoon. Look at the colour of that water. Let's get a line in. Yeah, we're gonna throw out a gar. Bit of an orange nose, oh, bottom beak tip gar. <laughs> He's up! Oh, is it gone? Nice! Oh, no, 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 no! Bloody sharks! There's a shark. Where is it? Where is it? He's on his way back. Oh! Oh, sh it. Straight through, nah. Can't fish here. Too many sharks. This is Brody. He's a true Australian lad. Um, yeah, it. took me out. He said he'd show me how to catch uh, squid for the first time, as I'd never caught one. And um, first cast, I got this beaut. But that was it for the uh, sort of hour we were out there. Oh, God. Is that the monster? 
the wind this time. As you just take the pressure on him. Now bring him into me. Keep whining. Keep whining. <laughs> That's your squid, mate. Right, here you take that. Hey, look at that, eh? There he is, the man with the squid. Now just let me kill him. Oh yeah, okay. Ink everywhere. And the... See how he just turned white? Yeah. Squeeze his neck. Yeah. And turn That's white. Right. You got this backbone yeah, all the yeah. way down here. Yeah. You get your nails. You get your nails and you break away the skin in behind its backbone. Yeah. So it looks like that. Yeah. Then once you've done that, you slide. You slide sl it out. Slide your finger. Oh, okay. Yeah. All the way down it, like that. Grab its head and its backbone. Push with your finger on its backbone. Yeah. Backbone all the way down. Okay. And then slowly, slowly, slowly pull. And all comes out. Done. Right. That's bait. Now with the skin, get a bit of sand. Put it on it. Now with the flaps, you can do it with the skin on as well. And it makes it, when you skin it, you don't actually have to put sand on it. Because you get your finger in underneath. Yeah. And kind of pinch. Oops. You can feel, you see that there? Yeah, yeah, so yeah. You get your finger underneath that. And when you do that, you can pull the whole skin off the whole way around the whole entire squid. So come off. that would come off with, yeah. pull it all off like a full cocoon, yeah. Okay, fantastic. And if you want to get really anal about it, you push the bum in, turn it all the way through. Like that. So then you get all that a bit more of a clean, thorough clean. But it's just a bit of squid ink, you know. And that's it, mate. That's job done. The best bait in the world. <laughs> Pop that when you throw it out. Pop that sack or you put it Oh, on right, it. yeah, so yeah, it, yeah. So it bleeds. Yeah. You throw it out and oh, more ink than you know it to bloody. Go crazy over that. <laughs> Brilliant. Cheers, thanks for the lesson. Much appreciated. No worries, mate. <laughs> <laughs> you just seem to meet such fantastic people when you're traveling around, like Brody and his wife. And opposite Mesa Camp Ground, you'll find the sweetest ball water you've ever tasted.